my students. How are you, everyone? I hope all my students are fine and do protect yourselves well from COVID-19. Right now, the time very special for you learn science in P6. Let's start watch the clip video to warm up before study. Oh no, oh no! I'm lost! Where's the line? Oh, it just went away! Do what do I do? Help! We'll be stuck here forever! Do not panic! Do not panic! We are trained professionals! Now stay calm! We are going around the leaf! Around the leaf? I, I, I don't think we can do that. Oh, nonsense! This is nothing compared to the twig of 93. That's it! That's it! Good! <laughs> You're doing great! There you go! There you go! Watch my eyes, don't look away. And here's the line again! <laughs> Thank you! Thank you, Mr. Soil! <laughs> Good job, everybody! Oh my, there's quite a gap, Mr. Soil. Shouldn't we tell the Queen? I don't think we need to involve the Queen in this. She's got enough on her plate already. Training her daughter... Oh yes, Princess Ada. The poor dear. Winds died down. They'll be here soon. Just be confident, dear. You'll be fine. Ah! There's a gap. There's a gap in the line. What are we going to do? It's OK, Your Highness. Gaps happen. We just lost a few inches, that's all. Oh, right. Your Highness, I can't count when you hover like that. Oh, of course. I'm sorry. <laughs> go ahead. Guys, go shade someone else for a while. OK, Ada. Now what do we do? Uh. Oh, don't tell me. I know it. I know it. What is it? We relax. <laughs> right. Oh, it'll be fine. It's the same year after year. They come, they eat, they leave. That's our lot in life. It's not a lot, but it's our life. <laughs> <laughs> Isn't that right, Avi? Oh, you're such a cute little Avi. Get shot! Hey, come back here! <laughs> Dot! Yes, Mother. What did I tell you about trying to fly? Not until my wings grow in. Right. But, Mom... Dot, you're a young queen ant, and your wings are too little I to be... I was talking to Mother. You're not the queen yet, Adam. Now, Dot, be nice to your sister. It's not my fault she's so stressed out. Oh, I know, I know. Oh, I'm always acting like the sky is falling. Look out! Ah! Adam! Princess Adam! Adam! My new idea for harvesting grain. No more picking individual kernels. You can just cut down the entire stock. Flick, we don't have time for this. Exactly. We never have time to collect food for ourselves because we spend all summer harvesting for the offering. But my invention will speed up production. Oh, another invention? Yeah, and I've got something for you too. Flick. Since you're going to be queen soon, you could use this to oversee production. Dr. Flora, if I may. Oh, this is all very what? nice. But... Just an ordinary blade of grass and a bead of dew, right? Flick, please. Wrong. It is, in fact, 
a telescope. <laughs> it's very clever, Flick. Hello, but... Princess. My, aren't you looking uh, lovely um... this morning? Not, of course, that you would need a telescope to see that. All right, listen. The princess doesn't have time for this. You want to help us fill this thing? Then get rid of that machine, get back in line, and pick grain <laughs> like everybody else. Like everybody else. Please, Flick, just go. I'm sorry. I, I was. I was really just trying. Trying to help. Harvester. <sighs> Why, we harvested the same way ever since I was a pupa. <sighs> Where were we? The food pile. When you watch the video of what you feelings, what do you see? Do you see the group of the ant? Most of them try to find out the food for eating. Why? Because at the winter comings, it no food. Animals. So right now is the summer. All of the ants can find out the food from the surroundings, and then they store it. If they don't try to do like this, that it means no food. Let's think about the food they eat. What it from? From the plants in that area. And another way. The group of the ants can survive. It's not only the food they eat. They need more non-living thing in there. That it means the air, the water, and the sunlight include temperature too. So why I show this clip video for you? You have to know well the surroundings around you that mean living and non-living. You are going to know well the environment, okay? So the first, you have to know the definitions of the environment. The environment that mean is everything surrounding you, okay? Maybe living and not living. So between living and not living, interacting together. So living can stay alive, that means they consume or need non-living thing for them. So that's why all of them we call the environment. All right, this is a new vocabulary for you learn about the environment topics. So new vocabulary that helps you to know well or understand what teacher talk about. Okay, the first, the environment. Two, biotic. Three, abiotics. Four, biosphere. Five, ecosystems. Six, community. Seven, population. Eight, organism. Nine, field communities. Ten, porn communities. Eleven, leap litter community. Twelve, lotting lock community and 13 seashore community and 14 garden communities so I'm trying to tell the meaning in Thai beside this please study and memorize it okay the environment is consists of two component or two main part that it mean to group up the component in the environment there are one biotic component, two abiotic component. If you heard the word biotic component or biotic past, that it means think about all the living things live in their environment. Biotic component, when you heard the word biotic, that is mean all the living things that live together in an environment okay and when you heard the word abiotic component or abiotic past you have to think about all non-living things factor such as water soil sunlight and temperature present in that area so right now I have the picture 
you have to study and answer yourself, please. List the biotics part and a biotic part in this picture. This is a aquatic environment. Okay? So you can look and study. Please tell me. Think about that. Which part is bio? Which part a bio component? Give time one minute. All right. Let's go to think about this. I will tell you. You have to check yourselves. Okay. So biotic, I tell you already. Think about the living thing presents in that environment, especially this picture. Biotic part that is. Crocodile, fish, shell, and plant. Okay? And a biotic in this environment, I mean in this picture, think about non living thing. That is water, soil, stone, rock, something that. And also don't forget the air, sunlight, or temperatures. I think everyone correctly. Okay, I would like to tell you more. Biological components of an environment. One, don't forget yourself. Two, you belong to a group of human or people. Some microorganism that is means small living thing. You cannot see example uh, coronavirus. Okay, that spreads around in Thailand right now. Abiotic pass or another word that is the physical component in the environment. What are they? One, the temperatures of the surroundings. Two, the amount of light in the surroundings. Three, the amount of water available. Four, the type of soil. So this is the non-living thing that present in the surroundings that we know well is a biotic component or physical component. Okay. Let's see. The temperatures in the surroundings so hot. So the temperature is higher on the sunny days. The sunny day that it means the amount of light come from the sun so strong. What is the temperature if the place is in the shade? If the temperature is in the chest, this is the area, is, uh, the chest area. This is no chest area, okay? So, the chest area, the temperatures will cooler than no chest area. Because when the rice come to the earth, this part is have the mountains protect the sunlight from the sun. The amount of light in the surrounding. The amount of light contain the temperatures of the surroundings. Okay. If more the amount of light is make the temperatures increasing. But if less the amount of light from the sun, it make the temperatures roll down. Okay. The amount of light and the temperatures of place interact with each other that I told you before. Okay. The amount of water in the surroundings. Okay. Let's think the water that available or can use it. If the temperatures of the surrounding is above zero degrees Celsius, that it means water will be present in liquid and available in the surroundings too you know when the water become the liquid that means we can use the living thing can use the temperatures of the surrounding is zero degrees celsius that it means freezing point the water will become solid that means ice if the water become ice that means we cannot use water. 
the water is not enough for living thing okay and this is the type of soils what are they one sandy soil clay soils and garden soils most of them are useful for the living thing stay there okay so example vegetable grow well in the sunlight yes absolutely for photosynthesis make food and then it will produce oxygen in the air. And another thing, the vegetables, it prefer to grow well in the, the loam soil or garden soil. It not prefer to grow well in the sandy soil, just some plant. And also they need water. Okay. Cactus and fern are not usually found in the same surroundings. Why? Think about that. Because they need different conditions. See? The cactus need a lot of sunshine, but do not need much water. So that's why it grow in the desert area. And think about fern. Fern need shade and need plenty of water. So that's why they are different area to grow. Now time to do homework one. Draw your environment, write a title in the middle of your paper. My environment. And after that you have to try to think about living and non living thing interacting to each other. Example. See? This is my environment that I prefer. When I draw finish, I make the color full. Okay. So after that, I try to tell the component directly that by your component success what they are and a biotic component success what they are something that. You have to think about that. So this is a one job for your homework. Time to do right now. This is for example. Okay? But don't forget you have to write at the below of your picture. Okay? That buyer and a buyer component.